Well, I'm gonna eat that. Hey everybody, and welcome to challenge number 17. Our third sponsored episode in a row. Yeah. Today we're eating artichoke hearts, quartered. And today's episode was sponsored by Vanessa Grubbs. Again, thank you. Two in a row. She said that these foods are probably not the most disgusting in the world, such as the last one, Hearts of Palm, or this one. But she said the average person doesn't typically eat them. We'll agree. And we've never had either one of them before, so. Again, it's also about broadening our palate. I almost opened that. Rick is in the lead still at 34 points. I just crossed the barrier for 30 last time. And I'll open this one. Ready? Shift priority, you think? <laughs> I'll find out. Okay. It's got a handy opener on it. Maybe not so handy as I would think. Ah, there we go. That looks funny. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Good. Smell that. Check priority again. What? That's so weird. I think it's the same thing, like, seeing so it just in water. It's a citric acid on the side. Really? Yeah. Fat free, low calorie, though. I think that's a heart. I'll have another one here. Yeah, that's a heart. If no one knows what that is. <laughs> yeah, it's in, uh, it says water, salt, citric acid. That's it. That's so it's an artichoke. Thing. I don't know. I would assume so. They look like fish fins. Boom! Alright, well, at least they come out evenly. That's something. Yeah. Well, no time to delay. What's it digging? They're leaking. I feel like we've had this before. It literally tastes like the heart of palm. <laughs> this one's chewier though. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it down. Uh, hmm. It's making the weird down. Uh, not fingers on a chalkboard, but like uh, fingers on a marker Just board. Like, yeah. yeah. Whenever you chew it, it just yeah. <laughs> I can hear it over here, but I can't hear it coming from you. <laughs> Victorious again. Yeah. I feel like we're getting better at this, guys. Ah, uh, well. Thank you, Vanessa. Yeah. At least, uh, at least we're getting some people, you know, sponsors. It, it, like she said, not the grossest thing in the world, but most people may not have tried it or may not eat it. Again, just like the heart of palm, though, it feels like it needs to go with something else. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure what, though. Almost identical. I, I prefer this over the hard palm. That's exactly what I was thinking. So I, I, you know, I give this what? I give the hard palm what? A six, I think, something like that. Yeah, just just over five. You gave it a five. Yeah. This right. I I will for sure give a seven. I I'm with you on that. I'm gonna give it a seven as well. It was better than a hard palm. A little easier to chew. Well, that puts Rick at thirty six points. I am at thirty two. I might have to eat another one of these right now. It's actually quite satisfying. It still smells like Chef Boyardee. Oh yeah, and then I'm gonna take the sip test again. Yeah, the water tastes exactly like the Heart of Palm stuff did. If you stayed around for the bonus at the end of the last one. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, well, so. <clears throat> Not bad. Aren't your cards? Pretty good. Join us Friday, where we do something. This is very out of the ordinary. Um, most people look at these when they get packages from FedEx, U UPS, uh, USPS, uh, packing peanuts. So 
I have a peanut allergy. This won't kill me, though. <laughs> See you Friday. <laughs>